beautiful cancers and welcome back to the channel i hope you guys are having a good day or night wherever you may be on this beautiful planet we reside in today's video is going to be your june 15th through the 30th reading as usual messages are general so they are not going to resonate with everybody if they do not resonate to your situation simply let it go and move on and be sure to check out any other amazing tarot reader here on youtube as somebody is bound to have a message for you However, if these messages do apply to your situation, be sure to let me know down in the comments down below. Give this video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, guys. It would be much appreciated. With that being said, let's get on into the reading. So what's in the most recent past for my cancers, please? That one. Most recent past for my cancers, please. One more, please. Recent pass for my cancers. One more, please. Oh, okay. So we definitely need to take a step back. We need to rest and really recharge right now because we've got our guards up and uh, we got our defenses up. We're not sure. Uh, basically, I, I feel as if you guys' backs are to the corners for whatever reason. And you really need to just, you know, take a step back from all of the chaos that might be happening right now around you or internally even. And really just take that time to rest and recharge with the Four of Swords here. Um, the King of Wands, I feel as if there is, I feel as if this is more reverse energy in the fact that you guys kind of, uh, I feel as if you guys don't know what to do or where to go or where to turn to uh, really bring balance and harmony back into whatever situation you're going through. Because the, the energy that I'm picking up is really chaotic uh, right now. So whatever's going on in your personal life or around you, there's a lot of chaotic um, lower energy around you, which is why you kind of feel as if you can't really go anywhere. You feel stuck. Um, there's not really much you feel you can do. Um, but your guides and spirit are telling you, you know, take time out step away from the situation if it doesn't directly affect you like if it's something you're kind of like stuck in the middle of uh then you know take a step back and be like guys uh this doesn't have anything to do with me and it's really affecting me in a negative way so if it's to do with like two outer people because like what i the image that i got was that you're stuck in the middle of like two friends or two family member two family members that are kind of like arguing and you're trying to be the peacekeeper so that that was the vision that i was given so and you kind of just like you don't know how to make it stop you don't know how to settle the the disagreement or argument that's going on between your friends or family members so that's that's the energy that i'm really picking up on and you guys just need to take a step back rest and recuperate for yourself and be like hey guys you know, you guys have to figure this out on your own. So what's in the present moment for my cancers, please? Present moment for my cancers, please. That one. Present moment for my cancers, June 15th through the 30th. Present moment for my cancers, June 15th through the 30th. That one. Okay. So, you know, things are going to level out. I feel as if this might be family like two family members just because the four of wands came out and that is a family card however uh with the chariot and the magician present if you want to move you have to move forward from this you have to you know take that step back and be like you guys you have to figure it out for yourself this is affecting my health um whether that is mental health whether it's physically making you ill um like tension uh stress whatever the case may be you just you need to take a step back and put yourself first in this situation and be like hey you guys got to figure it out yourself um i can't keep doing this i can't keep being put in the middle here 
So in order to, uh, you know, manifest, you know, this peace between the family, you, you have to just move forward and let them figure it out on their own. Uh, now, as for the most likely outcome, what's in, what else is in the most likely outcome for my cancers? Most likely outcome for my cancers, June 15th through the 30th. That one is jumping out. Yeah, okay. So I definitely see you moving forward from the situation. Um, and it's going to be, it's going to make you much happier with the Nine of Cups here. Um, the Nine of Cups isn't, you know, like the Ten of Cups, but you're content. You're happy with where you're at. You are completely okay with how things are going. So I definitely feel you being more content, being more relaxed um, because you move forward from the situation. But at the same time, you're going to be learning a valuable lesson from it. It's going to make you see things because of the situation. With the High Priestess, it's a very the High Priestess is a very spiritual card. It's about spiritual awakenings, spiritual growth, um, being able to see things from a different perspective. So what that's telling me is that because the scenario happened, when you finally do move forward, you're going to look back at it and you're going to realize some important shit that maybe wasn't apparent to you when you were in the situation, but now is. So we're going to get you an advice card. As usual, this could have something to do with the reading. It does not have to. It's just whatever spirit in your guides would like you to know at the time you are watching this video. So spirit, what advice do you have for my cancers, please? What advice do you have for my cancers June 15th through the 30th? What advice do you have for my cancers June 15th through the 30th on that one? Ooh! Watchtower of the South. Summer. Beautiful energy. Considering we are in the summer months now. Um, that's beautiful. You're going, um, uh, basically what that's telling me, um, is that be lighthearted, be playful, uh, be energetic. You know, summer months are all about getting outdoors, you know, doing things outdoors, being excited, playful. It's very lighthearted, fun energy. So basically what spirit and your guides are telling you with this or advising you with this is, you know, lighten up. Be more childlike, get in tune with your uh, inner child, do some fun things outdoors, go on a bike trail or a hiking trail, you know, things you used to do when you, you like to do when you were kids is basically what they are telling me. So yeah, that is your reading for all you beautiful Cancers. If this resonated, let me know down in the comments. It Give this video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, guys. As always, mwah, much love to you.